Hello and good evening. Here are news to anticipate tomorrow, 16th of April 2021. This is tomorrow's news today. On our COVID-19 update, African Center for Disease Control says they cannot predict when the second COVID-19 shot will arrive. U.S. imposes new sanctions on Russia, expels diplomats. World Health Organization says Europe has surpassed 1 million in COVID-19 deaths. And in local news, Nigerian government apologizes for power outage and irregular supply. Thousands flee after Nigeria jihadist attack kills 10 in northeast town. Federal government blames Nigerians and the media for Twitter's choice of Ghana for its African office. 31 communities in Imo states declare end to female genital mutilation. Federal government seeks speedy resolution of disputes in oil and gas industry. Lagos commences construction of rail line from Agbadu to Marina. NCC issues NIN enrollment guideline for foreigners living in Nigeria. And in tech, Jeff Bezos reveals Amazon Prime has surpassed 200 million subscribers, while U.S. imposes sanctions on Russia over cyber attacks. Now on the international scene, 15 sailors released after Gulf of Guinea kidnap while Mali post coup government says elections has been set for February 2022. Finally, in sports, Samaria wins 5,000 meter race but falls short of Tokyo qualifying time. For more interesting stories, do log on to guardian.ng and you can also get a copy of the Guardian newspaper at your newsstands tomorrow. And don't forget to connect with us on social media via Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube at Guardian Nigeria. Thank you so much for watching. I am Kemi Adebayo.